My Moby family, Claude here, and today I'm with Ivo and Di and uh, their Moby called Hollywood. That might be a strange name, one would think, but uh, once we get through this uh, exercise, you will see why it's called Hollywood. And uh, I'm going to let Ivo explain a little bit to us without getting into too much detail about what they've done. For instance, what they've done to the bed. That's really exciting. What they've done to their uh, lithium uh, setup what they've done to their tow hitch and then they've done some stuff on the roof and uh, it's it's like it's a whole new movie but this really brings uh, the lifestyle of uh, having a hotel room on wheels to a serious higher level so i will why you to help us and tell us what you've done so yeah, we went we went the, the full hog um, we I put on about 800 watts of uh, solar power and, and about 600 uh, 600 amps uh, of lithium batteries um, and then we've got an inverter uh, that uh, converts um, 240 into 12 volt um, and then we've got DC to DC chargers from the caravan um, to the car and so on. We're just looking forward to it and you know we uh, have also got electric beds. So yeah, that's, <laughs> uh, <laughs> that's absolutely amazing. I had the privilege to lie on them and and even got a vibration mode or massage mode. That's it, that's it. <laughs> you don't want to get out of the Moby when you, when you have that. You can do your own thing. You can um, set them up at different vibration levels, at different uh, posture positions. Yeah. Uh, so, yeah, so we're really looking forward to it. I've got an 80 series Land Cruiser. It's got the tyre on the back, uh, which sort of protrudes fairly close to the van in, in sort of normal circumstances. So this gives us a little bit extra uh, turning circle plus the actual um, uh, Mac hitch. Uh, it's the only hitch on the market that will give you an extra 100 mil automatically in mm -hmm. length without actually extending a drawbar or whatever. And then obviously something that you did that's also very advantageous is the fact that you are using the same rims and the same tyres on the Moby than what you've done on your Land Cruiser, yeah. which yeah. then makes it a little bit easier that you don't have to carry that much spare wheels. That's right, so it's the same same size wheels as the Land Cruiser, and in natural fact we've even got the same um, hub covers yeah. as well. <laughs> and then are you planning to, to give yourself a little bit more time to, to spend in a Moby? I mean, is there, is there a long, long, long term idea with a Moby that, that you're going to maybe uh, you know, try running a lap or doing something a little bit more. Yeah, uh, well, we do. Well, I'll, probably towards the end of this year, we're looking at uh, I might sort of semi retire from my job and um, I transport children with disabilities, uh, but I've got staff that can actually handle that for me, so I just might administer it uh, with the help of Starlink. Yeah, uh, I should be able to do that. Um, I've always really been a privilege to see how passionate you are about the brand and what a good ambassador you are and uh, we do wish that uh, we will see a little bit more of your um, you putting the Moby in, in its natural habitat so that we will see it up north and we'll see it in the bush and on the beach and all of those nice places that that uh, we hard-working people can't really uh, go and see and so we'll, we'll live our adventures through what you are doing. Thank you so much. Thank you, Claude.